All right, so I hadn't really done one of these videos in a while, so I figured I would give you a tour of the house kind of after we've gotten everything in. Uh, this is coming up the right side. You can see we put these little solar lights in. Ashley picked these out. Uh, I think it was at Home Depot. I think we got them. Um, I'll show you the garage at the end because it's kind of a hot mess. Uh, so we got these solar powered lights here, bushes. I still have to get a rake and kind of rake up some of this mulch. This wire here that's going along the yard, you can see there's like a wire down there that's going along the driveway. They're actually coming in in like a week or so and they're going to be burrowing the wire underground to uh, hide it. That's the internet wire and they still have to go underground and stuff and do all that. So let's, uh, that's our welcome mat. Uh, let's come into the house. So you probably recognize this is the living area here. Uh, we don't have anything really put on the walls yet. I'm going to Try to hang some stuff up probably this afternoon. We've got the uh, the dry sink here, the cat bed. Uh, these are my awesome blinds that I hung up that I am extremely proud of. Um, you come, I'll, wi I'll widen this video a little bit. Come over here. This is the living area. We got the uh, DVD and video game rack up. This is the couch, chair, television. That's the guy I watch on YouTube, uh, the lawn guy that I watch. <laughs> um, come through here, kitchen. You can see we've still got some boxes and stuff we need to unpack, some books and stuff that are kind of unorganized. You come through here. This is the kitchen area and the dining area. Hazel's over there on her cat tree. Hazy. Um, kitchen area. Island is still kind of a mess. We're still trying to organize the uh, <clears throat> just finding places for stuff. Um, here, this is the other side of the kitchen, that's the new coffee maker we got. We uh, replaced the old one that we had. We had the old one for like, I don't know, probably six, seven years, something like that. Um, kitchen here. Um, this is the stove that we're trying to get leveled and stuff. We're trying to get it up, trying to get it more flush to the counter, but eh, working on that. These are our uh, cabinets here. We're getting some of this stuff organized, plates, bowls. Got some stuff organized in here a little bit. Um, this is where the fridge will go right here in the corner. Uh, this is the pantry. You can see the uh, pantry shelf that Ashley built and put up and installed and everything. And got some random stuff here in the pantry air fryer popcorn maker chips cat food um i will spin around this way this is coming up towards the back door got the cat dish and stuff there master bedroom uh please excuse the mess <laughs> the bed's still unmade um we've got these are all clothes that we're putting away that's clothes that's clothes that's closed. Uh, so we're still putting all that away. Uh, we got the litter box here in the master bedroom. Dresser, bed. End tables there. More clothes. And into the master bath. Uh, these are the new bath mats and stuff that we bought. We got a laundry basket, a little trash can under there stuff here uh come over here we got the scale we've got some towels and stuff in the linen area toilet uh that's kind of the 
the awkward kind of spot that they put the toilet paper holder. Uh, we got a towel rack here, shower. Uh, that's our cat shower curtain. <laughs> uh, coming to here. This is the master closet. Uh, we're going to be probably putting the suitcases probably in the front closet, coat closet, I think. Um, but you can see the master closet in here. Um, I haven't really hung up any of my clothes yet. Ashley's hung up hers. Um, got some stuff up here, some stuffed animals and stuff. And so we'll make our way out of the master bathroom. And we will make our way to the office area. Um, and then I will show you the backyard and front yard and stuff. So you come through here, we have kind of a walkway through the back here. Um, we haven't gotten like the exact, you know, positioning of the furniture and all that stuff yet, but this is the coming into the hallway. We have a linen closet here in the hallway. Um, come over here. This is the middle bedroom, which we're kind of using as an office. I had, I had that pulled away from the wall when I was doing the blinds and uh, office space. There's actually nothing, I don't think in that closet yet. Uh, so we're working on that. I got to get the desk and stuff organized. Um, I have that top off the desk because that end there is still kind of broken and I don't know. It's, we have just been kind of leaving it off the desk and using it as a storage area. Um, if you come over here, this is coming to the guest bathroom. I'm probably going to be hanging this up today. Um, yeah, bathroom is a bathroom, you know. Uh, this is the guest, that's a new curtain that we got for the guest bathroom. Uh, if you back out of here. This is the cluster of a bedroom right now. We just got some comforter and just some random wires and stuff. We've got some stuff stored in that closet over there. Uh, air mattress, that's gotta be put away. Um, that's about it for that bedroom. Uh, let me take you to the backyard. This is the... Uh, Backyard here, the lawn and stuff is coming in pretty decent in the backyard. You gotta go through the storm door here. I got the chair and table out here, the ashtray. This is the side of the yard over here. Um, eh, it's coming along. They're still doing some work down here, you can see. They're still doing some work on that house there, so. Uh, this side of the yard is kind of a mess. Um, this is basically our back lawn. Ends kind of in the middle there. And there's kind of a weird bump here because they did this sod after they did that sod. So uh, this is the back lawn here. It's, you know, it's got some brown spots and stuff. and But it seems to be coming in pretty good. It's not too bad. Uh, I'm becoming a, a little bit of a lawn geek, <laughs> which was kind of unexpected for me. Um, I still got to put the lawnmower and stuff upright and get all that put together. Um, these are the little holes that we're getting in the concrete. I don't know if you can see that. We got that little hole there, that little hole there, that little hole there. Just getting these like little holes in the concrete. I will take you through here. And hey, easy. Say hi. <laughs> um, I'll take you through here uh, into the garage. So this is. Probably about two, three days after moving in. We've got the uh, coat closet here. 
Uh, probably put the cat carriers there. Probably throw the suitcases over here. Just got some board games and stuff organized up there. I'd like to put, I don't know, maybe another shelf or something. I don't know. We'll see. Um, this is the laundry room here. It's our new washer and dryer that we got for the laundry room. Um, pretty simple. This is the top load washer that we got. And it closes itself, which is pretty cool. Um, we've got some pictures and stuff up here. I'm just storing up here for now that we need to hang up. Paper towels and stuff. You know, it's a laundry room. Um, this is our garage. <laughs> so I have all these boxes that I need to break down and get tools and stuff organized. It's just a kind of a good dumping ground right now and a little bit of a hot mess, but I'm going to try to get all this stuff broken down probably this morning, kind of organize it a little bit better in here. Um, that's the cooler that we picked up. I got my shoes out here drying because I was cleaning the cat carrier yesterday after Cody peed in it. Uh, this is the fridge. Uh, this was Robert's old fridge. It's in a little bit rough shape, but, you know, got some uh, basic essentials in there, you know. Just a few basic things, but nothing in the freezer yet. Uh, I just have a thermometer. I have the thermometer going back and forth in the fridge and freezer. Uh, come over here. This is our uh, trash bin that we just got delivered. We got the hose holder that we picked up. This is the lawnmower that I picked up from you guys. Thanks again for the lawnmower. Um, uh, talking to my parents, if anybody else is watching this video. Um, I got to put that stuff down for the gutters. I picked that stuff up for the gutters. Got shoes out here. I picked up a shovel and a bucket to put dirt under the bumpy sod. Fire extinguisher, a little gas can over there. Um, yeah, just gotta organize stuff, hang stuff up. Um, that is about it. And I'll uh, show you a peek at the right side of the lawn. This side of the lawn here is coming out pretty good. Ours uh, divides about halfway down the lawn. The divide for our lawn, I think, is like halfway between the internet box there, cable box. Um, this this side of the lawn is actually coming out really, really good. You can see all back here, this, this grass is coming in really good. Uh, I'm gonna have to mow this before long. Uh, it's starting to get pretty long back here, so. Uh, we've got a few bare spots where they installed the termite control. Those are the little circles here. That's where they did the termite bond and stuff. Um, I have a bare patch of lawn right here. For some reason, when they did this termite spot right there, they tore the shit out of that sod. I don't know what happened, but I had to put a new piece of sod down there. And so I'm sure that'll green up over time. And uh, this is the what the street looks like and all the houses and stuff there. Still finishing up houses on the other side. So you can kind of see the neighborhood here. I think these houses across the street are pretty much finished up. Um, these ones are pretty much finished up across the street. Still working on some stuff down there. Uh, this side over here, still being done. Let me get out of the sun so I can see the phone. Um, this side here is still being done. They're finishing up this house next to us, a few houses down. Uh, those houses over there, those are still being finished up. They just put the siding on that house, I think yesterday, and the siding on that house on the top. So those are being finished up, but that's pretty much about it. Got to go in this uh, garage and get this garage organized a little bit. Um, gotta wrap the hose into the new hose holder. 
Um, I think I'm gonna unfold that folding table and uh, probably put some tools and stuff on it maybe. Um, we got this here. This used to be in our pantry at the apartment and uh, probably hold some stuff on there. These are the uh, arc faults that they put in. The little blue resets. Electrical panel. Um, so that's about it. Oh, this is the new LED. Let me show you this. My dad might get a kick out of this. Um, <clears throat> this is an LED light that I got off Amazon. That there. Uh, because they just had a standard light bulb in here and it was really, really dim. It wasn't lighting up the garage at all. Um, I don't know if it shows a difference during the day, but at night, I mean, it's a night and day difference in the garage at night. Let me turn the light off. Yeah, you, can, yeah, you can't really tell during the day, but at night, that LED light really lights up the garage really, really well at night. So, But I'm going to let you go for now. Go back in the house for a second. Hope you enjoyed the video. Um, uh, also, I was going to point this out to my dad. Uh, <laughs> see, this is the ceiling that I was talking about where they did the slope ceiling. It's like just really kind of weird. Um, just, I don't know what is going on with that ceiling, but it's just really kind of weird. I don't know. I'm sure it'll be some type, some type of warranty claim or something, but it just looks messy to me. I don't know. Like right there, we got these weird lines and stuff in the crease up here. All down there, like that all needs to be cleaned up down here. See? Yeah, I don't know what's going on there. Um, you can see another visible line right there. Like, it's just, <sighs> you know, fucking Roush Coleman. What are you going to do? I don't know. Uh, but blinds came out nice. Um, this is the blind here that I was saying was a little bit off. It's a little bit lower. It's a little bit lower for some reason on that side. It's not holding as high, but eh. overall, I think they came out pretty good, but I will let you go for now. Hope you enjoyed the tour. Um, maybe I'll do another finished tour after we get everything kind of put away and organized more and stuff like that and lots of people will probably be able to see the house when they come down in uh november for the wedding so that will do it for now hope you enjoyed and i will talk to you later